Hi, my name's Tom Ludd. I'm a freelance graphic designer and founder of the Designers League. Today I'm going to be showing you the export persona in Affinity Designer for Mac. Affinity Designer is actually broken down into three personas, the first being the draw persona that we're in currently, second being the pixel persona, and thirdly the export persona, which we're going to go to now. Now we're in the export persona, you can see we've got a vastly reduced amount of tools. These are the slice tool, the slice selection tool, the view tool, and finally the zoom tool. To create a slice, just click and drag over a section that you want to export. We're going to undo that though. We're going to export this artboard here, the iPhone. As you can see on the right here where the layers would normally be, we've actually got these icons that are now popped up. You can actually toggle whether you want to export sections of the design, which is incredibly useful, instead of uh, deleting them. So with everything selected, like so, we can click on slices. Now if we click on iPhone, you can see how it's bringing up these options here. We can actually toggle what format we want to export it as. Let's have an SVG and we may want to add another. So we also may want to export it as a JPEG. As you can see, we've now got multiple files that we're going to output it to. This is going to save you a lot of time. With these selected, you can obviously toggle around with um, the different settings and figure out what you want best, whether you want it uh, one times, three times, at different sizes, or different qualities. You can uh, tweak with them and play about. So now with that selected, we can click to export all formats for this item. As you can see, we can create a new folder and we can title this, let's title it iPhone and let's create that new folder and click export. Just like so, if I bring it up and we click on iPhone, you can see it's exported a JPEG and an SVG of the files that we wanted. There you go. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you got something out of it.